What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the One Piece World Seeker Let's Play. As always, I am Xavier, and in the last episode, Sabo showed up? Yes! Oh, one of the older brothers of Luffy showed up, Sabo, the holder of the fire fruit. Um, the Revolutionary Army's here, apparently, with him being here. Um, that's exciting. That's interesting that there's underworld stuff going on with this island. It sort of reminds me of Dressrosa in that aspect, with Sabo showing up in the underworld and smuggling. And we got a little bit of a teaser as to someone who might be trying to help, quote, in quotes, help Gene out, and I'm excited to see who that might be. So, to steal Plaza, we go. In the Plaza, are we gonna meet, um, I think her name was Jill? And it looks like it. I, th I think that was her name. Well, I know what I saw. I watched Jean get taken away with my own eyes. Oh, uh, yeah, her name is Jill. Uh, I doubt Jean could be so easily abducted, but I bet pirates are behind this. I saw some loitering near the docks earlier. Or it might be one of the pro-Navy Islanders. Those Navy lackeys always act like they, they're above the law. So what do we do? Should we go there now and settle things with them for good? Oh, that's not a good idea. Uh, hey, you, where did Gene's kidnapper go? Luffy. He headed south from the Navy base. He must be headed for Crystal Canyon. Uh, why do you ask? Are you planning to go there? Of course I am. I'm going to go rescue her. Jill, make sure these guys don't do anything until I get back with Gene. All right, I'll leave Gene in your hands. Sounds good. To Crystal Canyon. I've never heard of Crystal Canyon on this island. Um, I wonder if we've discovered it yet? No, we sure haven't. Oh, and we gotta walk all the way over there? Whatever. Um, where is it? Yahoo! Uh, what's up, old guy? How are you? Hey, stop. Crystal Canyon's under the Navy's jurisdiction. It's too dangerous to go any further. Hmm. I know, but I still gotta go. Hmm, it looks like your mind is made up. <laughs> that easy, huh? Hey, you can't. The Navy says it's too dangerous. Well, I wanna go. Alright, who am I to say? <laughs> um, it's a little steep, but you can go along the upper rocks. That'll avoid the sailors keeping watch down below. Uh, got it, thanks. Thanks, I guess. I mean, you're a terrible lookout for the Navy, if that's what you're doing. <laughs> but I'll appreciate it. Um, I don't speak of the devils. How do I get over there? The world government, what could they want with me? You're of no particular use to us. Your brother, on the other hand, my brother, then why are you bringing me into it? Why don't you just go and see him? That's just what we have done. If he were the type to listen to reason. Oh, I don't know why I paused like that. Um, but the Isaac I know is a calculating man. There is a reason behind everything he does. And until we know what that is, we must tread carefully. You're going to help me get information out of him. He may refuse to see you, but you're still his flesh and blood. Even you believe he still cares for you, don't you? What do you want to ask my brother? How could it be so important that you'd kidnap me? Several years ago, he agreed to research a certain substance found on this island for the government in return for becoming the island's warden. But lately, his reports have ceased. Or rather, he's intentionally stopped sending them. What we're mainly after is a conclusion of those reports. What's the substance he was researching? What is Isaac up to? Not quick on the uptake, are you? Or maybe you just don't want to believe it? You do know what I'm talking about, don't you? The true identity of your brother, the man who was hiding behind the warden's mask? My brother's identity? You don't mean... He's the one who's been smuggling black market weapons? The one causing all the turmoil on our island? That's just one of the ways he raises money. His real involvement is with the most dangerous resource on this island. I'm sure you know what that is. Uh, you don't mean Dynastones. Oh, and there it is. A plot twist. Yahoo! We're here to help, Gene. Uh, Gene. Pigeon guy? So you're the one who kidnapped Gene? Yes! Oh, mama, there it is. The one that, uh was teased in the last chapter. It turned out to be Lucci. Haha, <laughs> CP, formerly of CP9, now the newly established CP0, I believe is what they're called. Uh, Straw Hat Luffy, what are you doing on this island? Is this also part of the plan? I can't believe he'd incorporate a wild card like you. 
Uh, that's enough. What did Jean ever do to deserve this? Nothing. Uh, but that may be the real transgression. She doesn't even know her own brother, but at least she can be useful to us as a bargaining chip. Jean is not something for you to use. Let her go now. Uh, I refuse. <laughs> Transform! Alright, let's do this, Lucy. Come on. I'm in the front. Catch this red hawk. Bow! The last time we fought, uh uh. Nope. It ain't happening like that again. When I was on English lobby the first time. Uh, yeah. Bang! No, that was such a weak hit! Get down from there, please. I catch it. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, I missed! Oh, okay, some of it got me. That wasn't the entire effect I wanted. Oh, I should've went gear fourth for this. Hiya! Please! Oh, that was scary. <laughs> That's a big attack on the though. <laughs> oh, you know what? We still can. Come here. You, know, you can catch this Gear 4 death. I'll give you that much respect, Luchi. That was too easy. I'm kind of disappointed. I wanted the Luchi fight to be more exciting. I mean, it was still cool to fight him, don't get me wrong. Maybe it's just, like, I don't know. Because when Luffy first originally fought Luchi at any lobby, he was the toughest guy he had fought until that point. In my opinion. Um, having to use gear second and gear third multiple times throughout the fight and this time we just walked over him like he was nobody like that his health bar was depleting so fast anyways I'm sorry Jean let me help you out uh Jean are you all right uh thank you I'm okay let's hurry and go after him he's headed towards the southern beach gotcha chapter 10 Isaac unmasked Well, that was certainly an impactful episode. Jean got kidnapped. Um, we found her. Found out that it was Luchi who kidnapped her. That he's on the island as well. I wonder if he brought anybody else with him. I believe Kaku and Bluno are a part of CP0 as well. That would be fun to see if they're also on the island. Man, that'd be a lot of... Whoo-wee, that'd be a lot of big fights for the Straw Hat crew to deal with. With that being said, we'll chase after him in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.